to hey guys what's going on welcome back to another f123 my team career mode video and welcome back to the hungarian grand prix just to jump in uh, this um a video we've sold some of the land so we can um basically upgrade uh, some of the stuff uh, the research facilities as we're going into the r d menu now we we're basically come it's coming along well the r d facil uh, the facilities and the r d points and we're not doing too bad on um basically upgrading stuff on the car it's more or less me um pulling my finger out now and basically getting the results the team needs um, and I need if I want to challenge for this uh, world championship so at the moment we're just uh, going into quick practice and uh, basically um, making sure uh, we're getting as much R&D points as possible So that we can quicken up the car, and uh, we should find like races much e easier to compete for wins. Because at the moment, <clears throat> Max Verstappen is running away with it at the top. He's at four wins. We're on two with um, a couple of other people. So we've got to get our heads down and get on it straight away. Because um, I believe we can challenge for this world championship. Um, maybe challenge for. Um, another uh, the constructors as well but we'll have to just wait and see but as you can see just getting ready for the car nearly caught Nico Hülkenberg there but uh, Aiden Jackson is just in front of us for his first race for the team we're about a quarter way through the first lap in the car and I'm not gonna lie guys the setup I put on this car was meant to be an optimal setup but the car just felt disgusting to drive it felt very laboured to turn in, it didn't, it didn't feel good at all. So we're just going to have to uh, be careful and just bring the car home and just, uh, it's basically damage limitation, limitation basically, and just see what we can do. But it's going alright, we're posting green sectors, but everybody else in front of us, sorry guys, is like absolute rocket. So we go P22. That was the fastest we went, and uh, yeah, it's not been good. It could have gone so much better, but at the moment, it's just terrible. As we're going to go for the for a lap, another lap, just keeping the car straight. The lap this time so much better. We're like eight tenths up, so um, Magnussen gets out of our way as we're going to come up to some traffic going up the hill. Aiden Jackson's on the lap, so he shouldn't um, hinder us too much. But we're a second up here, but at the moment it's only good enough for like, like 17 or 18. We've just not got pace in the car at the moment. The, the car is just gross. It's, it's literally so slow at the moment. And there's nothing I can do to, to, to make it better, just keep the car in a straight line and just drive the, drive the wheels off it. There's not a lot I can do at all, but we're trying at the moment. We're 1.6, sec five seconds up. We're going to come past the line and it's 19th place as we're going to go to the Grand Prix, guys. Welcome to Budapest once again for another round of Formula One action. Historically, a good race for first-time victories with Button, Hill, Alonso and Heike Kovalainen and all reaching the top step of the podium for the very first time right here. We're northeast of Budapest for today's race at the 2.7 mile Hungaro Ring circuit. 14 corners here, eight to the right and six to the left on a track where downforce is king and passing is notoriously difficult. Off the back of a fantastic qualifying session, it's time to see how our starting grid looks like for today's race. Charles Leclerc lines up on pole position, edging out Max Verstappen, who'll start from P2. Considering the rest of the grid, we have Norris, Perez, Russell, Hamilton, Fernando Alonso, Ocon, Jackson, Stroll, Gasly, Magnussen, Sainz, Oscar Piastri, Sonoda, Hulkenberg, Bottas, 
Albon, William, Joe, Debris, and Logan Sargent. Now it's almost time for lights out, so let's go down to the track. And they've been involved in a number of costly incidents lately. That's got to affect their mindset going into this race. It's not an ideal situation by any means. When you get into a bad run like that, there's always the risk of frustration creeping in, which can cause more mistakes and locks you into this vicious cycle. Hopefully today they can get through turn one cleanly and stay calm for the rest of the race. Right guys, as we go to five red lights for the Hungarian Grand Prix, we get hold a little bit, lights out and away we go, we get a really, really uh, slow start there, a laboured start, but a second phase of start is pretty quick here, we're on the ERS, switch to the inside, absolute send it down about seven cars and we get in to P10, we've gone from last to tenth in a corner as we're going to go round turn three here and there's a virtual safety car as me and um, Magnussen get caught up he's lost his front wing he tried to make a, a move round the outside and then we he thought, uh, we thought much better of it and just um, pulled away in front and he caught us with the back of his car there's now this a virtual safety car is ending we're going to size Gasly up for a move and hopefully get the move done But also behind us, Lance Stroll is right beside us. We absolutely send it down the inside of Gasly and Alonso. Alonso has to get out the throttle and get out the move as well. But at the moment, it's been an absolute stellar job. We've got a lap after on lap two. Uh, Lewis Hamilton's made a move on George Russell. So he's moving up the field. And now we are behind our enemies, chat. Oh guys sorry uh, we are behind our enemies we are behind the red bulls and we're gonna absolute send and hell mary send and just get the move done as we size Perez up we slow into the corner get the move done very very nice move wasn't uh, barbaric and get the move done our next one is Max Verstappen as Gasly and Perez behind the sizing me up for a move but we go later on into lap six the two Mercedes are fighting ahead, and me and Verstappen are having a good old tuss uh, tussle as usual. But at the moment, Aiden Jackson in his debut Grand Prix is absolutely putting a shift in, which is nice to see. As we send it down the inside of Max Verstappen, as Russell and Hamilton are scrapping right up in front of us here. And we go to lap seven. We're going to come onto the back of Lewis Hamilton now. Size him up for a move. He's looking for a move on Russell because Russell's on the slow tyre at the moment. But the soft tyres are running out. Send it down the inside. Russell's actually looking for a move on Leclerc now as well, which is decent. Aiden Jackson's now in second place as we move on to the next lap. Lap 8. We're in P5 at the moment. P4, P3, Russell and Leclerc. Russell's trying to make a move on Leclerc, going down the inside. And we just send it. Three different tyre compounds being used here. We've got the move done. What an absolute move that is. As Hamilton and Perez are sizing them up from behind. We go to lap 11. We switch to the outside on Aiden Jackson. Go around the long way. What a move that was. It was a very nice move. But it wasn't even team orders. We've got the move done. And we were on the quicker tyre. So let's go. Sorry guys. On lap 14 guys. We are now in first place first place Norris is pretty much won this race but we're coming into the pits it was a bit late to come in the pits but we're gonna do it anyway so we're gonna have to have a bit of a fight back here so we're in the pits now and um, basically we're gonna be behind so we're gonna need to fight we're on lap 15 going into 16 and we need a good pit stop to get out in front of other cars and there's been a hold again it always seems to be the way um, I don't know what I need to update but that has just lost us time our right rear there was struggle going on here and we're probably going to lose a position to Fernando Alonso here we go really tight into the corner so we can't get a run on us but we're coming out in P9 it could have been at least P7 but now we've got some work to do 
we've come up behind Gasly. He's had a pretty decent race here, but obviously okay, he's lost ground okay. here in the fur on the further laps. We're still struggling to get the tyres heated up at the moment. But as we're coming onto the main straight, we're going to make sure. Obviously, we've got Alonso behind us as well. We're going to go to the inside here. Gasly made it quite hard for us to get the move done there. He was moving under braking, but we get the move done. We're in P8, and now we go on to lap 19. We've caught up with Charles Leclerc. He's not really had a good season this season. The Ferrari's kind of been very lackluster and very mad. But we're going to try and get the move done early as possible. Send it down the outside. You never see a move done there. And we're going to go side by side into the little hairpin here. We need to get dispatching very quickly. Just keeping a tight line on the inside and get the move done. What a move. As we go to lap 22 here, we've caught up the guys in front. We've made an absolute blind move on Carlos Sainz here. What a move that was. And probably in the same, on the same bit of straight, we're going to probably uh, size up um, Perez for a move as well. I believe that uh, Verstappen and Norris is too far forward. We send it down the inside. What an absolute move that is. We get a bit of a tank slapper on the corner. Now we need to chase down Aiden Jackson and Max Verstappen. Our teammate is going to make it hard for us because he's looking for his first, po um, first podium in Formula 1. But... With, there's no team orders in play here. We've got to get a nice, nice move done on him. Easy move down the inside. Very nice. And now we set off to try and get Max Verstappen. Aiden Jackson nearly comes back at, back at us here, but we get a move done. Very nice move. As we go to lap 25, we couldn't catch Verstappen. Lando Norris has won by 21 seconds, but it's another podium. It is P3, a very well fought race. Um, my p position I wanted to finish in was at least second. But with that pit stop hiccup, we are with P3. I do apologise, guys. I'm not longer out of bed. I'm so sorry. But there he goes. Ma um, Lando Norris gets his first maiden win in F1. Well, it, well, he was well controlled as well. He was really quick today, and he, he literally had a he had a rocket ship of a car. So he done so well to win the race today, and nobody could challenge him. But we give him his due. He was an absolute. He was an absolute. The man. The man of the moment today. Uh, me and Verstappen couldn't catch him. So um, GG uh, to Lando Norris. What a man. And for the champagne, the the championship is still open up for grabs. We just need a couple more dubs or it to get interesting and we can perform some scenes in the uh, latter part of the season as we go in to the summer break here. And um, yeah, things are good. Things, um, I'd say the first half of the season it was a mess start and we've picked up from there we've not done too bad to claw back basically what we lost from the two uh, races that um we didn't perform we dnf'd in as Aiden jackson slips down the order and gets fifth i don't know if that's because of the tussle between me and him but yeah um we are looking to um, create scenes in the next four, uh, four coming races and um, we just need to keep keep pushing and uh, basically the car has been reliable ever since but we might have to take a penalty at one point but we'll, wor we'll worry about that when we get to it but yeah guys um, it's been a great day, great race. We're making up positions, making up points. We can't ask for anything more, really. As we're gonna, as we're gonna take a quick look on the R and D screen, is there anything we can do? No, it's not. We could um, start doing stuff on the engine side. We're also gonna um, put the all the components up to four, a fresh, com well, a somewhat fresh component. 
uh, basically for later races to come. We're gonna, there's gonna be some icky moments towards the end of the season, but it's best to do the hard work now. And if we have a DNF, we're pretty much out of contention. But guys, if you want to see more, like, comment, subscribe, smack the, the uh, bell down below. I've been your host, William Ramsey HD, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.